Ladies and gentlemen, welcome back, Crab Champions. Let's get into it. We're going to be doing a little something called a guide, but instead of like in guide form, I'm going to really focus on talking my way through the run and like do it as we play, right? So I figured, what do people want to see? Well, obviously, diamond. That's the thing everyone wants. But look at me. I'm rocking the ruby skin. I'm a lonely ruby player. I'm, I'm not. I am diamond, but... Let's imagine we're Ruby. Let's imagine we're struggling with one of the weaker weapons in the game. If you haven't seen my tier list video, go check it out. The Flamethrower. Definitely a tough one, especially solo, especially on Diamond. Nammo. True Nightmare. So let's let's just attempt it. Let's see how it goes. I got mine in co-op, so this might actually be pretty challenging. But I think that if you're in the right mindset, if you have a good understanding of the weapon and how to play with it, then... It's not terrible. It doesn't have to be terrible. Obviously, RNG is still going to play a, uh, a huge factor. But, for example, we're already rocking lots of fire element. And that's a close quarters weapon. Pretty pretty close. I mean, let's see. Wow. Well, okay. You can hit him from here. So, uh, it's actually... Can I hit him from here? You barely. Barely. The spread's a little bit tough. So it's medium range, but really it's more of a close range to actually get the good DPS. So, how do we kind of not have that suck? Well, I'm thinking either laser beam, or maybe we're getting stuck close up and we need the grapple hook to get on out of there and get our movement up. Those are the two ways I would do it. In solo, uh, black hole actually ends up being a little bit pain because see how the barrel's like woo, woo. and it kind of got stuck on the side but enemies kind of slingshot around and I don't I don't know I don't really like it I'm gonna turn up my mic a little bit louder a little bit louder uh so I don't I don't know I don't like the black hole right now <clears throat> so I think I'm gonna go I think I'm actually gonna go grapple to just give myself movement because especially not in co-op like it's solo everyone's focusing on me all the enemies, they see me, and they want to kill me. Right? Pretty straightforward, obviously. So I want to be able to move. Uh, dagger. No. Claw, honestly, it has a lot of knockback, and that's huge for creating space. Especially, again, we're rocking solo. So we got True Nightmare on, on and, uh, you know... I don't want sentry. I want something not shit. Layered grenade, no. I, I'll, I'll abuse the key totem on this one. Collector, there. Nice, nice, well-rounded damage perk. Good for this run. So, I've blabbered enough. Let's get into it. Going to be extremely important not to take a ton of damage early on. If you dig yourself a hole at the beginning of an island, or the beginning of a run, you're just going to have a hard time. You're going to have a hard time. And that's a no-shit statement, but at the same time, it's like... You really, especially at the beginning where there's just not that many enemies. I hope I don't jinx myself, but you really should go flawless. I almost just messed it up there. And I keep getting stuck in these trees like an idiot. But I am trying to continue to move around, keep distance, and uh, except when I'm going in for melee, right? So that was not very pretty looking, but I successfully went flawless. And then we can get something like high caliber, which is a nice damage increase, but lower clip size. I don't... I don't think it's that big of a deal with the flamethrower having 45, and we'll eventually try to find something like efficiency, or all you can eat, or even auto loader. Whereas spiral shot might be a little bit goofy. I might, I think I'm actually going to take that. I went from 45 to 34, so that's that's pretty stinky. But yeah, 66%. That's pretty solid. Honestly, is spiral 100. A spiral might have been the move. So here we go, random or double econ. Econ is huge. Econ can make or break your run. Especially with the enhancements, which are now a pretty damn expensive way to become overpowered. So you need Econ. Yeah, Elemental Explosion sucks. Yeah, Spike Strike sucks. But at the same time, it's Island 2. It's not going to be that hard. Yeah, it, I mean, it's not going to be easy. And I'll probably take damage. Mm, there it is, right? Uh, but it could definitely be a worse combination. Now, me getting stuck in walls like that is not doing myself any favors. Yeah, the range is definitely tough on the flamethrower. And the two damage, even with the 66% increase. That means we were at one damage to begin with? My good golly gosh, that's low. I already knew that, in theory, but that sucks ass. <laughs> so I get it. 
But that built-in fire shot level 2 is not too bad, so it's a give and take. I just keep on getting hit, but it seems like the damage isn't too bad, actually. I really should be using the grapple more to create distance. I'm, I'm kind of getting greedy trying to get through this faster than I need to. You don't have to rush these runs. You're not going for speed runs. You don't have to auto loot. You don't have to uh, try to kill everyone instantly. I mean, it does help at times to be fast, surely, but it's not the end of the world. Oh. There you go. Not too bad. I took whatever that difference of damage is. Almost 45 looking like. We get two econ chests. Let's see what we get. Special delivery. That's nice for obviously shop income or shop variety. Sorry. Income, but 380 crystals. I don't know if that's going to make a difference. Finishing move. If I go crit, that could be huge. But do I want to go crit with a flamethrower? Ah, I don't know. I don't know. Gold coating, gain crystals when healing, unless you get a heal build going. Like, this is something where if your healing is really good, maybe on island 55. Ugh. Wow. It's like, that was like a yawn, but it sounded like puke. Anyway, if you're on like island 55 and you already have a good healing build, then yeah, yeah maybe grab gold coating. But until then, no. Uh, so this is actually a tough... Uh, little decision right here, right? Bonus Crystals is a very good perk. It's epic. It's, what, 50% bonus? And you get it to level 2, level 3, level 4. It just kind of goes crazy. But, Money Shot, I'm getting a lot of hit markers with these flames. Now, does every proc of a fire get it? No. Just every projectile. So it's going to be better on something like Minigun or Laser Cannon, right? It's still good, but here I'm actually going to take Bonus Crystal. And then here I am going to take Special Delivery just to give myself more options. And then Double damage. That is very tempting, but relics are the best, like, just categorically and, like, objectively, they are the best pieces of loot in the game for most builds. Like, they're just so helpful. And I, I, I don't really know the official number, but I feel like the chance of getting a relic portal is very low. I don't know how much lower it is than, you know, damage and skill and all these other ones that you see all the time, but it's definitely low. Another thing that's nice about flamethrower is like you can just get these little pockets of fire on the ground right here. Boom. See? It does damage to him. So you don't have to hit them straight on. Now this guy's gonna be annoying and he might. Yeah. I'm giving a lot giving up a lot of damage here. Not the best, but there we go. Fire takes him out. Relic chest looks like a legendary portal ring for Ooh, Coral Amulet, obviously. I thought I'd have three choices here, but yeah. Coral Amulet, extra two choices. It's like big chest level two. Off rip. We like that. Tempting to go spiked, but I don't know. Spiked has become less and less important to me in my runs just because, like, the items in spiked can be in everything else. It's not like there's things that are only available in spiked chest. It's like, yeah, it's nice to get the epics, but it's a built-in fire build. Go for the fire. Go for elemental. It makes sense. Fire's decent. And here's the thing, though. Flamethrower doesn't have to just be fire. An arcane thrower would be nuts right now, especially for two ammo or two nine. Now, something I am struggling with right now is staying on one target. But there we go. I avoided those attacks. This is going to be a brutal attack if it does hit me. God, the sound. It's nerve-wracking. I don't know when it fires up. There we go. Not too bad now. A little lightning ant. A little lant. A little lant. Yeah, you ain't got nothing. All right, go over here and see what we get. A lot of options. Flammable armor. That could help, but I don't really have a lot of other fire shot stuff. Hot steam. There we go. When they extinguish, boom, damage. And then flammable armor later in the run would help with hot steam. Hot steam proccing a lot. That's nice. Ice shot. Obviously, we don't care. Fire strength, that could be huge, but there is a fire strength relic, so I kind of want to hold out for that. And honestly, random shot might be more helpful. Now, obviously, if it uh, if ice shot procs, that kind of screws you over, but you can get poison, you can get all these other things. I actually want to go random. And then here, hmm, not going to do it, not going to do it. Okay, spiked. We've got two more, so I'm still going to avoid spiked. I just, especially early on, like, I, it's just a, it's a ballsy choice. Using these rocks to my advantage, especially early on here. Movement 
it's not that great. That's okay because these stupid little crabs are gonna come in. Monster crab. Alright. Uh, playing a little dangerous here. Playing a little dangerous. I probably am one hit. So, this is where the range does seem to stink. Okay, I'm not one hit because I got hit. <laughs> <laughs> the melee is a lot stronger than you would expect it, it takes him out pretty quick Especially compared to my damage Which is still at You know, 2, right? Ultimately I'm at 2 It's not that high Rigged totems, efficiency, autoloader, or driller We'll take efficiency So we don't have to reload as often Let me get a glass totem here for spiral grenade That is, that's ultimately actually going to No, I don't want that messing up the loot pool. That sucks. I don't want it. Uh, speed is very good, but XL and Spike, kind of low health. I don't have any health items. I'm going to go health instead. And please, God, do not. Okay. Wait a minute. Okay. All right. Okay. This is going to be a hard island. This is going to be a hard island. Oh. oh. I gotta start getting some kills, or I'm screwed. Wow, this is a wide open space for these laser skulls. And I really do not feel good about it. This is a tough one. I don't know if I'm gonna be able to strategically... You know, just kind of reason my way out of this one. Although they are kind of all in a single spot, so if I can get some fire going, I might be dead. I'm definitely dead, right? I'm definitely dead. I'm one hit. And there's a freaking... Any of these fires are just going to hit me randomly. <laughs> so another part of the strategy is do save scum early and often. In a dumb spot to go. I'm stuck. I died. Why did I turn my back? Don't turn your back like that. <laughs> He's getting flustered, ladies and gentlemen. What a great guide. Oh. Oh. No. Get away. Oh, my God. Momentum is key, and I am losing it. Now, if I didn't have grapple, I think I would have died by now. But I'm also, you know, missing out on some good damage. Like, if I put a uh, laser beam right there, it could have been huge. Okay, Ant, like, you're just in the way. Yeah, that's GG's, right? I backed myself into a corner like a dipshit. Yeah. Ah, oh, man. <laughs> Flamethrower is tough. Flamethrower is tough. But we're going to go again. I think I can get that. That was just... If I don't let my health get that low. Right? That's what I said. At the beginning of the the, uh, the run. I was like, you just cannot let your health get low early on in these runs. And yeah, I'd say within the first biome counts as early on. You got... Really, you got eight biomes now. Right? Four, two loops. You're not even an eighth of the way in and you're getting effed up. Like that's dumb. Very dumb. Whew. A little bit better of a start here. What do we get? Damage. Ring of power. See, that could be huge. That fire rate reduction is brutal. And this early in a run, it's not like I can be like, oh, well, I already have five levels of rapid fire and one level of supercharge. So I'm fine. Eh. That's going to... Uh, that, that'll... I need that though, right? Oh, no. All right, we'll try that. I mean, effectively 500%, so increase by 500%. 500, what is 100% would be one. So it's a plus five, so we're at six, or are we at seven? Jesus. All right, this will be very interesting. Yeah, we're at six. 
Well, it is it is smacking. It's just like the slowest, so my damage per second might be lower. Buster. <laughs> this is uh, this is gonna be weird, but we'll keep going here. Line fire, more damage, but spread is increased. Spread increasing while also not having fast fire rate is gonna feel really bad. Yeah, you see that shot randomly to the left? That's craziness. Alright, well we can get some speed back here. We have taken damage, which is not ideal. That was awesome. No, that was really smart. This is the kind of mistakes. These are the kind of mistakes that you don't see in some of these recordings. Because editors cut it out. Because I look like a garbage player. Maybe I am. Stay in the piss! Yep. So that's why you go claw, man. Claw just yoinks him back. Oh my god! A grapple hook, but instead of it being a grapple, you pull them in. You don't pull yourself to them, you pull the enemy in. Hooks them in, dude. Roadhog. That'd be sweet. Anyway. Light shot. Speed Demon Blender. We'll go light shot just for the 15%. That already feels way better. That already feels way better. I think that's good. We do need health. We do need speed. Which one's more important? Right now, health. I want to get to a point where I'm not on this island dying. I probably will take that challenge towards the end. Is this a gas? It is a Glotum. Danger close. That's actually huge. Both for our melee here. It's basically a melee perk. Get back there, Buster. Getting a little bit flustered, Buster. Dude, he rhymes? No. Yeah, yeah, we'll take this. Okay, well, could be worse. We'll see if it's worth it. What item did I get? He's so good. They they don't really hit you in the air. All right, focusing on one at a time, and he responds, dude. That's so cringe. Wow. Healthy combo. That uh, it's not like I don't know. If you're going to combo build, great. If not, eh. uh, I could just heal. I could take armor, or we could take scavenger and just like that's just that's just decent heals for the rest of the game. Twenty five. It's not much uh, later in the game, but for now, it's huge. Also, a flawless demolition greed. Ooh, I'm not going flawless on that, but I still want the greed perk. Or we go double elemental, but it's mirrored and shrapnel. Ugh. These both kind of stink. Am I doing damage? Sir! <laughs> Am I doing damage, sir? Maybe I need to go melee it, but then I'm too close. Nice! He gets it done. <laughs> One down. That spread is brutal. Blind fire stinks. This one I'm gonna go for the middle one because the splash damage, right? It might uh might hit them all. And there's the flawless. Ruined. Get away from me, dude! Break already. See? Huge movement. Huge. <laughs> huge move. Really movement. Alright, that was very sloppy, and I don't think I got any scavenger either. We still have one more. Yeah. Oh, damage seeker increase, but lose max health and take damage. Alright. 150. So my weapon damage is at 641% and global at 250. I mean that's that's good, right? Like I'm in a good spot. It's just can I survive this freaking island?
Yeah, six teams is fantastic, right? But getting smacked by minigun crabs is not. Not so. And choosing to go. God. Hit the shot! Whoa! Do they, uh, do they have good target? Good target. Good targeting, good aim. Have they been doing any Kovacs training? So here, my, my strategy is quite obviously, like, I can't really afford these guys to hit me. Right? Oh my god, that was... Alright. It's clear the skull is going to be an issue. So we get rid of the skull. If I can actually hit these guys, like, boom, they're dead. It's just... How hard is that? Because I'm not in a position of accuracy. I'm not in a position where I have an accurate weapon that shoots where I want it to. And that's really tough. It's also very hard to tell when I have fire stacks on these guys. I don't know what that is. Like, this dude is so low. Whew! That was way harder than it needed to be, guys. I'm not making it easy on myself by just kind of letting... I'm losing focus and getting, like, antsy. You gotta you gotta relax and... Like, I could... I could have just taken nine years on that fight if I really needed to and not, you know, not lose any health. Anyway, healing is more effective. That's great. That's just great. Uh, second win when my health is low. My health is low a lot. That could help. If you if you feel like you're going to struggle your way through this run, you're not going to end up getting like a juggernaut build where you got 4,000 health and 6 armor plates at all times. Second wind is great. Normally though, 25% is so low. Like I will be back up to full health. Right? So I'm not going to take it. But, you know, in hindsight, like obviously that would have helped if I had had it on that island, right? So... Need three more crystals. Doesn't matter because nothing is enhanceable. So blind fire might not be the move. I think my spread being increased is not helping. Checklist will eventually help a lot. Endurance will also just help survivability. Hot steam obviously good for the fire build, and then uh, armor is armor. So I think I'm gonna get rid of blind fire because I don't like that. And god damn it, man, I do want checklist so much. I can afford it, but it's like, or I could get these two for 1666 and I can afford that for this 1667 makes sense look at that look at that math baby uh, I could also just like get rid of scavenger it's not that great healthy combo I could get rid of not that great scavenger is great but <laughs> it just that's not that great now I'm saying it's great scavenger is okay endurance is what 50 every island whereas this like as more enemies spawn 5% of them will drop health you will get more health from this later in runs so, not a bad one to get. I do think uh, healthy combo is probably a freaking waste. But getting rid of one thing is not going to move the needle. 275. I think the smartest move is checklist. We'll see. We'll see. Uh, you could go either way on that, I think. Um, I am banking on the fact that I'll be able to get a lot of kills and make it far in the run for checklist to be worth it. Because checklist is definitely, like, really good. For long runs, but on you know island 30, 32 I guess. Yeah, we're going with 64, like not that great. I do want to get rid of the poison boy first. I'll probably die from fire stacks, maybe. There we go. Now fire is obviously going to be extremely weak against the poison, the poison, the elite fire skull, but we have the ability to still deal 15 damage per hit. So. This is honestly not a hard fight, but losing the armor, again, like, I'm just kind of playing stupid. I could have definitely gone flawless on all of these so far. Yeah, I'm just not. Maybe it's the fact I'm recording. I don't know. Money is power. That's helping long term, but honestly, for heals, Grim Reaper is going to be way better. And then I'm going to take... I'm going to take the heart because it's 150 now. It's, it's a lot. So we're actually finally on to the second biome here. The vibes. So now we can definitely get rid of Scavenger because we have Grim Reaper. 
Fire rate is still dismal. Not a fan. But at least it's not quite as inaccurate as it was when I had good when I had uh, blind fire. And because I have so much global damage, my melee is actually giving me a nice little crutch. Like, yeah, I'm not a melee build, but I can just do that. And that is more effective right now. There's nothing wrong with building into melee, building into grenade, and then getting rid of it later in the run. Or just, you know, your perk damage, your global damage, because that affects everything. Global damage ends up being way more important than weapon damage in general. And like time shot, that's crazy. That's crazy good on any build at this point. It, I, I, I will eventually do a like top items in the game, like top 10 items, top 10 perks, top 10 mods. Time shot might be up there, man. As a weapon mod, shit, it's good. It is genuinely good. I do, here's, yeah, I think I'm gonna be ballsy. I'm feeling pretty good. I'm feeling pretty good. I wanna see what I can get here that's epic. Also, just look at that and checklist. Checklist proc three times just there. I get it. Is it not ten kills to proc? I thought it was ten. Ah! Oh yeah, watch that one hit me. See the global damage. The uh, the grapple. Grapple's hitting like a truck. Ah uh, yeah, is. Yeah, 10 kills. So I must have got 30 kills right there. Total damage gained 7. I forgot. We've got the stats screen. So here are my stats. 670, 257. Those are the numbers we're really looking for right now. Obviously, crystal gain. Let's get that up to 500, 600%. Uh, I'm probably not going to go crit here at this point. But I do have time shots, so I could. And then, yeah, cool to see uh, checklist. 7%. So that's cool. Anyway. I'll do that at every shop if I can remember. Bulletproof, that is nice and helpful. But something like Thorn Shot. Ah, uh, what's the proc chance on that? Thorn Shot's very good. It, they're, they are homing thorns when they proc. But on something like this where it's slow fire rate, will Bulletproof be smarter in the long run? I don't know. I want to... I'm tabbing out here. I'm going to... Let me go look this up here on my little weapon ranking. Flamethrower. I said very low damage because it is. Uh, low proc rate. Okay. And it's not that fast. But it ends up being like a medium, medium low proc rate. <sighs> you know what? I can just go on the actual Wikipedia. You guys are missing out. You're not even seeing what I'm doing. Stinks for you. Thorn. Control F. Took me a while. I had to retype it. Alright, flamethrower 7.5%. Eh. Eh. That's pretty shit. I'm gonna go bulletproof. Try to stay alive more. Econ, I need it. I need it. I got nothing. And yeah, speed I need too, but I need econ early. If, if you don't get econ going ever, you're just like, I don't know. You need enhancements at this point. That's another big thing. I'll, I'll really... Hammering that down. Like, why are you guys... I feel like... Maybe I'm overgeneralizing. Maybe the Discord's weird. Maybe the people on Reddit are weird. Maybe something's weird, but... Use fucking enhancements. What are we doing? Like, by far, the best way to win is to just have, like, one decent mod that's triple enhanced. You don't need seven things at level one. You need a couple of good things that are enhanced. And you want those enhancements to not stink. But... Fuck of the draw at that point. Anyway, uh, I'm going to go get these crystals real quick. That was a very sloppy island, but uh, that's all right. Why am I so slow? All right. Econ, finishing move, gold coating. Wow. Is that another round of this shit? Well, five grand. We'll take it. Skill or crit? I'm almost thinking I should have gone crit. Instant regret. We'll see. We will see. Skill can be great. Crit is kind of just always smart. I don't know. I love that it's only a few. It's like half a second. So is that just lower damage because it's a uh, an ice skull? Even though the projectiles have projectile damage, it doesn't have to be fire. 
Oh my god. I'm just being sloppy. I'm recognizing it. It's still not... It's not changing. What the heck? Good aim right here. Get him. Prank him, John. Alright. Sloppy, but... Oh, you know, win is a win at the same time. We move forward. Reload arc. That's huge. Reload arc is genuinely decent. Look at that. Wow. And it's enhanceable. Do we just abuse reload arc? We could. You have to ultimately play it as it lies. We're, it's golf. It's a really... It's oceanic, fast-paced, roguelike golf. You you get dealt cards. And you gotta, you gotta play the card. Play with the hand you're dealt. I'm gonna just say all of the stupid cliches. But, you know... Maybe we didn't think we were going to do a reload arc build, but look at that. Watch this. Let me just reload on that guy. Boom, basically dead. Let me reload on you too. Boom, basically dead. I don't even have to use my weapon anymore. I'm just going to spam reload arc. It's like a one second cooldown. It's like a one second cooldown. Look at that. Boom, both dead. Get hit by the projectile anyway because you stink. Boom, there it is. Boom, there it is. All of a sudden... We could probably get rid of all of this shit. Also, by the way, ring of power. Ah, oh, it's weapon damage. Okay, okay. Weapon damage. If that was global damage, I would be losing my mind right now. Also, another econ. We're getting small. Finishing move. And crystal dividends. God, I was I was waiting for gold coating. A, a fourth time or third time. Uh, crystal dividends is by far the best econ item. Assuming that you're not a dumbass and you're not always sitting at, like, zero crystals. It's just, it's exponential. It's crazy. So... Yeah, 5% bonus after clearing each island. So yeah, 5% of 8,500 is going to be 855 by 2, right? 425. Not that much. But when we start cranking up into the 30s and 40s, it's going to be a huge difference. Huge sums of monies. Okay. Oh, oh no. Oh no. No, no. Weep. Like that voice crack. I, I tried to go wee, but it went. Just nothing came out. It's nighttime on a Friday, all right. I, I had a lot of work meetings, but I was like, I want. I'm trying to. Play, I'm trying to play crap, dude. I'm trying to record something, something or other. Do you guys like these? Uh, I mean, I'm probably not even gonna bother editing in an intro. Eh, I'll probably. I'll probably. We'll see. Note to myself: <laughs> I might cut like that first round. Pretty shit. But it's still learning. It's still like. I had, I had good points in there, so I'll probably keep it, actually. But yeah, how do you guys like the, like, longer... This is drawn out. This is slow-paced. I'm saying things that aren't actually funny, because I'm trying to be funny. You know? But how do we like these? Do we appreciate these? Do we want more of these? You gotta... Wait, let's have a dialogue. Comment section. It works. I want to make content you guys want to see, right? I don't just want to put bullshit into the world. Speaking of bullshit, what is this chest? Heavy grenade, wind-up, and glue grenade. I, I guess I could take glue... It's not, but I, I'm just contaminating the loophole. Like, I don't... You pick stuff up, instantly, you're more likely to get that duplicate as opposed to, like, a random thing, right? Just slightly, but it's there. So why would I just get a bunch of grenade mods? I don't care about grenade. Hey, newsflash, for, uh, <laughs> for Namo runs, you're better off focusing on the weapon. But, obviously, sometimes you, you know, RNG screws you and you can actually get a good nade build or ability build. But for the most part... They're kind of just uh, helpful abilities. They're not your primary damage source. So, I don't want glue grenade. I don't want heavy grenade. I'm using this for movement, not for damage. But wind up... I, uh, so, I got 45. Is it plus... Damage increase 2% up to 100 shots. So, I'm at 45 times 2 is 90%. Not even 100%. Not even... And 100% is like of 1. Oh, that was stupid. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, fuck that. Get that out of there. That's stupid. Does not work for the flamethrower. That's okay, though. That's okay. Ooh. I might, uh, I might lean into the... Yeah. I don't care about healthy combo. Might lean into the, uh, reload arc here. We'll see. Gamble totem, eh. <sighs> 4,500, I could... I could do it twice. Or we could get money shot, we could get firework shot. Firework shot's decent. Firework grenade, worthless still, but the shot is okay. We can get some armor. So maybe I go two plates of armor and we enhance. 
It's not that bad. The armor's not worth too much, though. I need armor. I need protection. Let's see what we get. Flaming. Well, that works for the build, right? Works very well. Now, do we attempt to get rid of even more? Or are we fine with that? Sturdy totems. Like, do we... Or do we gamble once? That's worth it. We like hot steam. We can afford a slot. All right, let's move on. That was actually a pretty good shot. Like, yeah, I got 1,400. I could gamble more. I could maybe, uh, like, in theory, 800. So would that give me enough? I think I could salvage that. Just all, Yeah. In theory, I could salvage. No. It'd be 2,400. So I can't do that. But what I'm trying to say is... Yeah, I could probably spend more money and get that down lower, but I have crystal dividends. We want... 1500 is not a lot, but it's still going to be nice to have that crystal dividends proc on 1500 instead of proccing on like 200. And he's out of here. Woo! Goodbye. Bye. Lightning him. Or fire him. Flame him, John! Yeah, look at those fire stacks from... Freaking reload arc because it got flaming. That's insane. The two second cooldown is BS too, because it by the time you're done reloading. Oh, okay. All right, all right. Maybe it is full two seconds. Anyway, that was that was insane. And I'm clipping that. Or clip, clip it, dude. It's going on the Reddit. Wow. Give this guy 50 views. <laughs> anyway. Spark shot, scatter shot. Now we're talking. Ladies and gentlemen. Both of these would be great. Eh, or grenades. Decent if you if I would have taken blue grenade, but either way we're not focusing on the grenades the abilities Spark shot is very nice, especially if you get like splitting or homing or sticky or any of those Enhancements, but scatter shot is going to literally multiply our shots because no matter what Like there's a lot of gravity on These stupid things and they're gonna bounce a little bit just a little bit of bouncing and honestly if I got actual bouncing shot Then it's 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 jover. It's freaking jover. Also Let's get into some real strats here you don't even have to attack enemies. Just use the force. Use the cacti. They are your friend. And so is Reload Arc. My good golly gosh. Right. Red Fury. Eh, I'll see. I'll see. I don't know if I want Red Fury. It is free damage. Whereas all this crap is free nothing. I'll take Red Fury. We'll, we'll buy a slot for it. I can handle that. Same thing here. This is a great island. It was very hectic, but it doesn't have to be. Now I have all slugs. Oops, all slugs. And a skull. Can be hectic. We got another bonus chest. Another, uh... What are they called now? A lesser chest. If I can hit... The skulls in midair. Ah, take damage. Didn't need to, but we get the lesser chest. Yeah, this is a hectic, but again, just skirt the outside. I actually haven't really said that much in this recording. Um, for the most part, just skirt the edge of the map. It's like really easy to avoid people if you do that. Oil can damage, increase to burning, or poison shot, or arcane. Now here is a very, this is a good opportunity to say, I still think poison is the best option. Just increases damage overall, but arcane is a close second. Arcane and fire like on paper fire stacks do more damage in the same amount of time if there's equal stacks so god runs you're going to island 400 fire is actually better <clears throat> but arcane like across the board has double the proc chance so yeah by island 400 you have 100 percent proc chance go fire but for normal runs arcane is literally double as good <laughs> because you're just going to proc it more uh, but either way, obviously, we're going to take poison because poison is great. And a poison thrower is fantastic. And I don't even think I've done that yet. I did an electric uh, lightning thrower. We could take an elite. I'm very confident that I could smack it. But I don't actually have that much health and some more health items. Maybe some healing. Maybe cool. Especially like that. That's a, that's a good way to eat up a freaking armor plate for nothing. For what? I'm going to focus on the cacti, because they do killings. And I'm 
almost only using reload arc for kill. I'm, I'm shooting just in, for kill. For singular kill. <laughs> um, yeah, I'm just shooting a little bit, enough to reload. Enough to get it to uh, you know, reach its cooldown. Because, yeah, the flame's already falling behind. I'm still gaining damage, but, it, but it's slow and steady. My fire rate's still very low. Ultimately, my weapon is not that great. So we have to use what we get. Use what we got. And right now, we have a very good flaming reload arc. So we'll do it. Ring of healing. Fully heal when entering shops. That's surprisingly nice. Nourishing salvage. Or bullseye. I guess I'll take this. That's it's okay. It's okay. I I don't know if I want to get ballsy with the elites right now, and I haven't really taken a luck in a while, so I think I'm gonna do that. Also, it should be very easy for me to smack these nests with uh, reload arc. I don't know why saying reload arc. It's like slipping my mind every time I want to say it. With uh, uh, what's my perk? What is this? What is this weapon mod I'm abusing? Oh yeah, reload arc. Yeah. Get him. There's that nice uh, chain reaction. One more, maybe. Yeah, there is. See that you don't really have to focus on the enemies that much in demolition. It's it can end up being pretty easy. Obviously, you need the damage to take out the nest, and the nest probably still have too much health. But it is true nightmare. Like these things are not going to be easy just because. You, like, you complain about it in Discord. I don't know. Uh, efficiency would be smart. Autoloader would... I don't know. I'm starting to think autoloader might actually be better. They're, they're both good. You deal damage more often than you kill, but when you gain ammo back, you don't gain a full mag back. Whereas when you get the kill, you get a full magazine. So, you know, whatever. Driller's going to give you more items over the long haul, but I don't think... True Nightmare is the type of environment where you're like, wow, let's do a maximum loot build. Like, Driller, Rare Treasure, Big Chess, Coral Amulet, all these things. Like, I don't really think that's the place. So, I think I am better off going for something like Auto Loader or Efficiency. I'm going to go Efficiency with the Flamethrower. And I'm going to go Greed. And personally, I'm hoping for Double Trouble just to make it a little bit harder myself, you know? I just like a challenge. Let me back down for the challenge here. John, you would like a challenge. Does that do damage? Does Reload Arc do damage to the Cactuses? 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 Dude, am I damaging the Cactusy? Or what? Am I also, is Poison doing any poison? Poison shot. What do we got? Ah! <laughs> when in doubt, reload that arc, baby. Cringe. Alright, what do we get? Double edged sword, gang crystals. That's nice, we'll take that. Can buy a lot of slots here, but they're nice. A relic horde on the last island of a biome. That, my friends, is nice. If only it was a flawless. And we get the extra lesser chest. John, it's a lesser chest. I do not want to fall in that little pit. I think on this island, my strategy has always been to stay up top, or I'll do like one of these. Like, I'll be like, oh no, I've fallen and I can't get up. And then I freak out because I miss it almost. And then I go up here and I kind of skirt the edge up here, especially if you have like marksman rifle. Beautiful from up top, just rain down. But yeah, same thing though. I'm going around the edges, I'm looking for the cacti. Because they're just like actually doing a lot of damage. And like, I probably. Could have farmed some more income right there at the end, but that's okay. Blue grenade again, like we just we don't want to dirty up our our loot pool and keep getting crap that we don't need and we do not need that. We're gonna be loading. Nah, we'll take Tony's. We'll take Tony's. Lots of uh, scavenger spots. See, scavenger is working. Even though I have low health, I'm staying at relatively full health. If you get hit a few times, not a big deal because there's scavenger all over the ground, just like this in the actual run. Uh, we're gonna go again. See what we get. Homing. So now Reload Arc is doing that. Well, <laughs> you still have to look at them, but if they're all homing, that is obviously the best enhancement you can get. Uh, and 
especially for this build where I'm inherently a fire build, getting flaming is huge. So just look at the amount of fire stacks. It went from like 300 something to 600 up to almost 900. And then right here, like, yeah, it's going up, but it's like, it's almost just consistently staying the same. Now it's finally going up a little bit. And then reload arc boom. So for all intents and purposes, this is a reload arc build and that's fine. I would like to get poison higher just because it's nice to get poison. Scatter shot could be cooler. 15% feels low. Here I can get more. I could also get a heart, which would help a ton. Hot steam would help with the fire in general. This is like giving fire the poison aspect, right? Enemies will take more damage. Oh no, hot steam is when they extinguish. Sorry. I was thinking of... What was I thinking of? Fire starter? Probably fire starter. Anyway. Never mind. Do I want this though? That's the real question. And bulletproof, like just make it so that I really don't ever take damage. Could be nice. Nine plus seven is six, but it's like really 10 plus seven and a half. I can't do it. Uh, I really do need more health, like God damn it. Scatter shots, probably not doing that much for me. I could try to go for another enhancement as well, but I think for the time being, we go the health, we heal, and then we get in there. Unless I want to get rid of something, but eh. Crystal Dividends, I think it's fine. Oh my god. Alright. He's a fire enemy, so it's going to be a little bit harder. But I'm not too worried because I am able to keep distance on this map. Like, yeah, that attack is a lot, but I'm, I'm back here, buddy. I'm back here, buddy. You're not hitting me. I don't know why I went with a southern accent on that, but... Same thing with Elite Barrel Skull. This island is so wide open. It, it's honestly a joke for a Elite fight. And I'm sure it'll change eventually, but I was in, in no danger of getting hit ever. So, we'll just take that win. Easy. Move on. Check out the loot. And there we go. We get Juiced and we get Arc Shot. So, this is actually a harder decision than you would expect. I think a lot of people... <sighs> Here's the thing. A lot of people say Juiced. Wow, Juiced. I love Juiced. And I love Juiced too. And I do need Fire Rate. And damage is nice, reload speed's nice. But Arc Shot is going to it's gonna be a low proc rate at the beginning, you know, that's the thing. That's the thing that sucks. But if I turn this into like a spray and pray where it's a, a, like a fan of fire, then that could be really cool. But I'm gonna go juiced for now. I'm gonna go juiced juiced for now. Decision decisions. That's what these games are all about. And honestly, I can uh, I can do the thing where I just go whoop. Just watch it, watch it home. <laughs> so crazy. Goodbye. <laughs> that poor crab. What did he ever do? Oh, these poor crabs. Yeah, the homing is crazy on reload arc, dude. I'm taking damage like an idiot. But now I'm just taking damage. That's okay. Still good. Still good. We got a parkour. We have uh, a little bit of crystals. What is that? Gamble chance, whatever. Who cares? Snake shot, dagger blast, damage combo. I'm at a 4x combo, which is weird because I definitely took damage. So I'm not sure if that's glitch. But hey, we do not argue. We just take advantage of that because now. Look at the stats, 45. I also haven't really shown stats in a while, so let's do that. Yeah, damage combo with the 4x combo. 45. What else is important here? 52% total damage gain from checklist. That's not bad. Total damage block, 51. Is that damage instances or just literally the total damage block? Because that seems very low. That seems like less than one attack. I think it's block damage 51 times. That's my expectation there. Look at that. Crystal dividends giving us 7,200. Very good. Trust is... Man. 655 weapon damage 347 global very nice obviously there we got the flaming and the homing so yeah the build is coming together a little bit i'm happy so far i don't expect to lose but i do need to play a little bit smarter here five percent for a 25 percent chance at a random that's fine and i will go parkour just because that should be a guaranteed epic right just should be but you never know you never know these days Sometimes I still mess up.
like that. Almost went too far. I get nervous. I don't know why. Yo. Good song. Scatter shot or crit blast. We're not going crit. Scatter shot will be nice. Up to 29%. So almost 30. Now we've got a good decision. Rush or crit or a double damage, but it's homing thorns and homing barrels. I can keep distance because I can just spam reload arc, but there are some islands that are not helpful for this. So, uh, ooh, I want to do it. I want to do it. Oh yeah, this ain't too bad. It, it can, it can be poo poo, but I don't think it's gonna be. Oh my fucking god, what is that? Is that a regular? Am I stupid? What is that attack? Is there is there a fire pumpkin? Like an actual fire pumpkin, not like just a pumpkin, like a fire pumpkin? Like what am I seeing? Is that a fire pumpkin? It is. He's tiny. Why is he small? I hate this. Get him out of here. Dude! Fire pumpkin! Scram! <laughs> Skedaddle! Hey. Thanks, I hate it! Look, he's, he's dying. Look at all the fire stacks. Dumbass. Get him out of here. Alright, there's one enemy being stinky. I'm also not... I, I forget. I forget that I have... Good old grapple hook. I can get out of dangerous situations faster. I'm just not doing it. So, very dumb. Clip size reduced. That might be worth it. Might not. Danger close could be sick. Glue shot could be very sick. Right? Big shot... I think I'm gonna go blue shot because if you find aura shot, by the way, blue shot aura shot, go to combo. Obviously, still goaded. It used to be OP, now it's still OP, just not as OP. It might be the best on flamethrower, better than any other weapon. I, uh, I know that's an aggressive statement, so we will, we will see. But my God, it's good. Skill or crit, but it's horde. Crit horde. Hordes are nice. Like if you are, like damn, I'm gonna die. Guess what? Go on a horde, run away from the enemies for a minute. It's really not that hard, traditionally, but it, it is definitely dependent on, like, you know, the island layout. And unfortunately, I don't know. A lot of the, uh, a lot of this biome feels samey and not in a good way. Like, this feels the same as the last one, but even more cramped. Like, this outside edge is typically not super thick distance. But then you got this cool inside of it, so I don't know. I don't like this star fish. Get the fish out of here. So right now, I am just trying to keep space. I'm not doing a great job of it. Especially because I can do... Oh, I missed. That was silly. I missed. I can do this. and just like really go crazy. And then just hit with a little harden. Healing ever so slightly with our Grim Reaper, level 1. That guy's done. That guy's done. Not too bad. So that's the strategy there, I guess. Coral Amulet could be huge, but Reload Arc level 2, this is a tough one. Coral Amulet will be better in the long run. Each projectile dealing 20 damage is not very high. But, ah, fudge me, dude. I'm taking Coral Amulet, but in the future, like, we need to get more Reload Arc. So, this could be a silly, that could be a silly goober mistake. Okay. Jesus Christ, our Lord. Kumbaya. Okay, no, nope, 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 get out of there. 
So what's my strategy right now? Well, Cotton, it's pretty simple. Uh, run around and explode the John Johnsons. Can you just, like, get away from me? You know what would be really cool? If Reload Arc did more damage based on the amount of bullets in the magazine when you reload. But then it would be way too strong for a minigun laser. So, maybe that's stupid. Maybe don't listen to me. Noise Storm? Don't do it. Light shot, fast shot, stamina. Fast shot effectively increases range at the end of the day. Do I actually want that though? That would be helpful. Do I want it? Or do I take a slight damage hit for the fire rate? How am I not getting <laughs> rapid fire in this? Like, that just sucks. So I guess I take this. We go waves and I... Do I take damage immediately because I want to heal? Yeah, I think I do. I'm cool with that. I'm cool with that. We break all the crystals now, or what? All right. Banana, bronze heart, or armor. I have a couple combo things, so I would like to have armor. Would help me out. All right, we will take one more. Well, we got freezing. I don't know how that's going to work. I think they're just negating, right? So maybe I, I ramp up hot steam. Enemies take 50%. Damage when extinguishing, they'll just instantly extinguish all the time, which will instantly proc that 50 damage. Ah, oh, that sucks. That that that's RNG for you. Maybe I maybe I should have been like, hey, I got flaming and homing it. Leave it at that. Should have left it at that, man. I think for now we do that and, and just hope that hot steam procs a lot. It does a hundred. It does kind of... Ah. Ooh, that sucks. All right, let's see how it goes. Let's see how it goes. So far, I'm not seeing much in the realm of going well. I mean, they weren't going to have a lot of fire stacks anyway, but... Now I'm just dying. Now this should be a winnable fight still, but I don't know if I have it in me right now. There's just so much going on. I'm not shooting at the right one either. That'll definitely help. Oh my god. Don't get hit by that, you fudging flippity flip flop flooper. Oh, did I, uh. Got a lot of health. I don't know when I got it. Oh, I don't have a lot of health now. What? What just happened? I'm like. I'm like trying to lose. Huh! Just kill some of them, please. Yeah, Grim Reaper must be going crazy. This is, uh, not, not going well. But what do we get? Power slide for fire, eh. Freezing enemies for freezing. Why, though? 
Crit lightning, spore shot, or bomb explosion. I mean, spore shot's generally good, but... Like it's a fire build, baby. Power slide. Ah, uh, really? It's like a lot of items, and I'm, I get those. One, two, three, four, five, six. I'm like, that's what I get. Wow. Wow, we, dude. Spike strike as a grenade is actually so bad. Bomb explosion, bad. Bad for grapple. I don't know what to do here. I don't know if I'm gonna get the win here. I, I don't wanna, like, commit to freezing. The hot steam, like, uh, has not the move. Spore shot is more poison, but the proc chance is low, so it's... Also, where's... Look at the chest on the right. The chest right there. It, like, disappears when it gets too close to the edge of the screen. What the hell is that? Anyway, um... I guess I go power slide... I don't know, man. All right. Time being wasted. I do like that there's some knockback, though. It'd be nice if I didn't just, like, instantly lose my armor, though. But I don't have a lot of health, so... It's, like, obviously I'm losing it. Who's replicating? What are we doing? What are we doing? This guy's healthy, huh? And that's just not doing a lot of damage. Nothing I have is doing a lot of damage anymore. This is tough. Fast shot. I'll actually take that. Banana. Great. Time shot, spark shot, danger close, ultra shot, ultra shot build. Go check that video out. Ooh. <sighs> Time shot. Okay. Here we go money. Honestly, I want to. I want to rebuy. Reload arc. It's so. Honestly, with the looping, scaling anyway, like it's not doing crap for damage. Yeah, look at that. It's not doing crap anymore. It doesn't even matter. It doesn't even matter that I got the stupid... Freezing, you know what I mean? Yeah, it's not... It's not getting the job done. Nothing's getting the job done. Actually, actually, though. Alright, yeah? Get away from me! Me and my 30 health, like I'm dead? Yeah? Am I dead? How much are they gonna anti camp me here? Gimme! Ah! Oh, the cooldown! The cooldown! It kills me! Actually, the cooldown though, fuck. Oh my god. Dude, I, I'm healing. So much. Alright, that guy sucks. Send him downfield. They'll, they'll eventually home. Like right there. <sighs> yeah, 
I don't, I don't want this. <laughs> I'm gonna lose my mind. Also, like, what if there's a dude back here? You know what I'm saying? Just send him downfield. Come on. Do, do the reload arc. Do the arc. Do the arc. God. Well, uh, that's a lesson in patience, ladies and gentlemen. It's all on purpose. Shops always contain best that's 75 off. Then I buy it, then I sell it for more than it's worth. Let's go, dude. Um, I think, uh, yeah, crystal dividends. Or I could just take this, which would, like, make the existing crystal dividends so much stronger. 10%. Yeah, it'll go up to 15. Great. Or... Short term, given that like I might die, like I can still definitely lose this run. I'm gonna take this because I know that like if I do make it to the island, to the shop, especially on this fucking island, dude. This one's like all time pain in the ass island. I don't, I just kind of try to melee the uh. Give me my... If I honestly didn't have the homing, I think I'm way worse off. Even though it's like not dead... Oh! God! No. no. I ran right into it. I was gonna say it's not doing much, but at least I'm like putting some stacks on him and the ice isn't always canceling out the fire, so it's like not too bad. Ah, oh, that sucks. That was winnable for sure. Low health, low health. So, third time's the try. Potentially, we'll see. But I will go ahead and switch to laser beam. I think the movement's great, but I think being able to deal damage with the beam will be better. And then I think that that's yet another example. Like, I'm on island 34 with 700 max health losing armor and, like trying to hold on with 80 like it's not gonna happen you know it's just not gonna happen way too low and the healing items i did get ended up being like healing not actually max health like boom do that i booped him into it um yeah I lost my train of thought there, but that's fine. Orbiting shot. Now, here is a situation where one orbiting shot is just crazy rare for no reason, even though it's just a rare. The drop chance is super low. It's actually very good for flamethrower, but it is, you know, you're kind of just a fire tornado. I don't know if I actually want it. Like, it just spreads the fire around, but you're spreading around anyway. I don't know if I want it, ladies and germs. Do we take it just to see? I'll, I'll take it to see. It is a decent damage increase, too. Honestly, the, the fire projectiles seem to have a pretty large hitbox, right? Because I'm sometimes like minigun. Like, it's an actual like small hit scan projectile, basically. It's not hit scan, but it maybe like laser cans is a better example. But it's like tiny, so if you're like jumping, if you're, like, jumping like this, like, you're not hitting people below you. But it seems like the flame is, like, already an aura, you know? So maybe it's very good. We will have to see. Crystal Devonans, let's go. Yeah, it's definitely hitting stuff, like, below me. Below me, dude. Alright, this'll be... This'll be the move. This'll be the move. That's crazy. I know it's just Island 3, but feels very very overpowered paycheck could be huge right now too it scales too it scales a lot higher than it used to it, it, it was like level one 250 forever and now it's like level one 47 <laughs> but it goes up a lot uh so it scales with the with the island you're on so that's kind of a a an investment in the future of the run we'll see maybe it was dumb maybe not you decide. Yeah, this is this is tearing, dude. This might be a really good, really good build. Like genuinely. Last cannon. 
Down to 60. It's not that bad. I thought it was going to be worse. 250%. So we are at weapon damage. You can kind of see it. 225. Global 350. It's pretty good. And to be honest, I might go speed. I don't know if that was the move. It's crazy how fast you melt the stronger enemies. Like, I am... I'm uh, playing with fire by taking glass cannon. I'm quite... <laughs> playing with fire. I'm... Yeah, I'm probably one hit. So, that's tough. I've been neglecting crit. Let's just take crit. Let's see how it goes. You know what it is? It's that the range is, like, way... Way wider than you would expect. It, it looks like you're maybe I don't know, five feet in front of you, but it's clearly going really far. So I mean, we take those, and then we we try not to die by the miniguns. Okay. See, that's lucky, because it can hit in front of me, but it'll <laughs> to zoom around and get him in the back. Hit him in the back. What? I got, him, I got him with the back shots. Wow. Sharpshooter. Hot shot's better, but more risky. I'm risk averse right now. Nothing is enhanceable. So let's uh, let's buy some health probably. Paycheck level two. That'll be it. So let's take a look at the stats. There you go. Not not too crazy, but already 350 and 225. Not not bad at all. So this should be relatively easy, but I don't know where the enemies are. Well, that, that'll be a little bit hard. That'll be a little bit hard. Actually, what am I talking about? It's easy. They, they, they just get melted. Why is it so strong? <laughs> I'm losing my mind. Hey, I've been sleeping on it. Oh my god, I get all you can eat? Crit blast? What's my, my crit chance of 7%? Wow. Fire claws, no. All you can eat, right? Yeah. And a heart? 125, but it's gonna be what? 60, 80% uh, worse, so 20% of that. Which is like 12 and a half times 225. Wow. We'll take it. I was right. Look at that math, dude. Quick math. I'm gonna do it. I don't even, I don't even care, bro. See? I didn't I don't even care. IDGAF, brother. Crystal dividends. Cribidends, dude. Get him, John. John got him. Not a bad run so far. I, again, though, I'm squishy. <sighs> ah! It's ballsy, man. We're getting, we're getting ballsy. We're getting cocky. We're getting penis. Some could even say. With these strats, these build strats, where I'm always low health. It's not the way I should be doing it. Like I should not have taken glass cannon, but in hindsight, it's 2020. And obviously, like that's why my damage is so high. So it's such a hit and miss. This was a very quick board. We'll take that paycheck with 570. Look at that paycheck already killing it. 570. The Crystal Dividends already has gotten me 906, 7900. So Paycheck right now is outpacing Crystal Dividends naturally with uh, how low we are. Speed Demon, I can run around a little bit faster. Ring of Swiftness would be clutch here. XL Spike Strike, mmm. Mmm, that is a recipe for disaster. So I'm going to avoid that. What I am going to do is take everyone out except... Bit, uh, a little bit tough there. Ooh. Just like hoping I don't get hit. Fire starter, fire strength increase. There we go. So what does that actually do? Just stack. Basically stacks. Apply 25% faster. Or 125% stacks, basically. Oh yeah, am I hear that right there, John? I'll take Driller. We'll take Driller. We will hope to get some decent items. And then what we're gonna do is pop that because it doesn't matter. It's like the 
fire rate is a lot higher than I think. You know, maybe I was so used to the slow fire rate last time with the items I had. You know? Because I just feel like I have way more projectiles than expected. And then we're gonna get lightning shot. Like, I get, you know, I'll take it. I'll, I'll take it. Not bad. Heavy hitter. The damage of fire rate reduced. We like the fire rate, though. We do like the fire rate. Here's the thing we like the fire rate. But heavy hitter. Heavy hitter's decent. Or sharp claws. It's still pretty good. I don't <laughs> Another demo. Another day, another demolition. Derby Island, brother. Do not hit me. Oh, I swear to Christ. We'll have some issues. Aerial shots, like, I don't know. I am in the air a lot. And it's, it's not a decrease in damage if you're on the ground, so might as well. Do, 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 do. Critical arrow. <laughs> oh. uh -huh. That could be insane. Crit arrow could be nuts. Okay, what do I need? Like 70? I have no heals. So I could open one. It's the last one on the island. Or I could take a double elite. I'll, I'll, I'll take this. Assuming I don't freaking die. Which doesn't seem like I will. Maybe there's a healing rock. Getting a lot of income. Income, baby. Alright, that guy's mean. That guy's rude. All you can eat, really helping us out. What the fuck? Why? I'm so mad. I'm going again. <laughs> Why do I die there? Uh, really? Dude, it's the skin. I promise it's the skin, dude. So what do I do there? Turn around? This is stinky. Damn it. That was that was it. <laughs> Operation find <laughs> orbiting shot again. Maybe we can focus on health this time. Oh my god, golly gosh. Zigzag pattern, what is it, 100%? 50, oh great, oh boy. We'll go health. Maybe we take health 100% of the times that it's available. 100, not 99, not 98, not 80, 100. God, take damage there, you fucking idiot. I'm angry at myself. Bye! Uh, yeah. Yeah, that's right. I frame. I frame that. I ate that shot. I frame. One shot. I'm not getting those. Fortitude. Yes. Yes. Gosh. Yes. Give me another fortitude. You won't. Dude, if I can just get up to like 5,000 health, it's Jover for these hoes. Yeah, dude, are you are you a real fire crab? I'm the real I'm real super sand. I'm the fire crab around here, okay, buddy? Come on. Who do you think you are? I am. Who do you think you are? <sighs> Alright. Take the health. Look at that! Oh, this is gonna be brutal. Oh, this is gonna suck. Oh, he made a mistake. Oh, he's a dummy. Oh my good golly gosh. This guy sucks. Why do we watch this creator anyway, dude? These are so spread out on this island too. This island is so fun, but not for demolition, dude. Can we have it on regular islands? I feel like I don't see it anymore for regular. Also, why are we getting so many energy rings randomly? Seemingly random energy rings. 
popping up all over the Crab Champions universe. Well, this universe. Bada bum, bada bum, 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 bum. Ow! Just keep getting hit. I saw the crease by 25, though. We're fine. Stop crying. Why are you crying? All right, big hearts. Big hearts call that Barts, baby. And we'll go crit. Crit and health. Let's just go back to the basics, right? Here I am acting like I'm giving the best advice. I can't even get it done. But honestly, I'm losing because of like skill issues, not strategy. You're not hitting us, right, buddy? There's no way. There was no way. No, another one? Like you have to just go in there and get it done, but it stinks. Very tough fights against these shielded lightning crabs next to a shielded fire crab or whatever that was. Crit blast, hot shot. We'll take hot shot this time, and we'll take health again. Hit him with it. Yes. You stink. You think you're the shit? You ain't even a fart. Mm, mm, I'll be going hard. Mm. I know, I know. You should have me on the track. Better than she is. Alright, this these the, the, uh, the spawn seem a little bit aggressive here, huh, John? Yes, John. Well, this is true nightmare. After all, you are a little bitch. Get him out of here. Oh my god. The cooldown feels like way more than five seconds. For the laser. Gosh. 25 more max health. And that was the last one, so we are spamming the crit. Okay. Alright. No, that's fine. I don't even care. Our target to reduce damage that is incoming from... Hotshot. Increased by 20. Increased by 10. So, you might wonder why the incoming damage down here is at 108. Could this not be plus 20 minus 10 as a net of plus 10? What are we doing, John? <laughs> the math isn't mathing here, guys. I don't know what to tell you. Aura shot! Ooh, he's getting it. Yes. All right. A little, a little zesty there, huh? Wrong guy? I mean, what are we doing? Oh, suck, my dude. Stop it. What are we doing damage? To him. Come on, John. Let's find freaking Glot. The quest for glue shot is upon us, as Orshot has been commandeered. We're commandeering this vehicle. The SES... Flame of Eternity. Helldivers, dude. This elite skull is being very... He's having anti-democratic thoughts. I'm getting pissed off. Alright. Chai! Hi, buddy. Yes, the computer is very warm for you. Not too warm, though. What are, what are the specs here? What are the temps right now? CPU at 60. GPU at 53, dude! This crap champions is easy to run on a 48 super. <laughs> And 7800 3DX, dude. This guy's got a rig. Yeah, I, I uh, got a nice bonus from the corporate overlords on my annual review in uh, it's January, but the bonus hit in February. So your boy's like, you know what? Man, we're just gonna do it. I was tired of the 5800X. That shit was hot as fuck and not very good for gaming. I mean, it's good. It's, it's not bad. But, like, come on. It wasn't even a 5800X 3D. And I was like, at that point, I just would rather go to AM5. And don't even, don't even suggest Intel, okay? Get that shit out of my face. No, Intel's great now. Very power hungry, but whatever. You can limit it. Do a little undervolting, you'll be good. And then, yeah, I had a 4070 Super. I was like, yeah, that's obviously good. But, like, what if, right? Like, what if? What if we just, like, went for it? What if we just spent way more money than you should ever spend on a computer part? I was like, I mean, I could. So I did. Yeah. Yeah. So that's how that went. But then, 
The 4080 didn't fit. So we got a 4080 FE, but why not? Glue shot, we got it! Uh! All right. Well, GG's. Now I just need to play smart. Uh, yeah, we're rocking an end case M1 V6.1, dude. The GOAT of the SFF community. T1 who? That's what I say. Ghost. <laughs> Loke Ghost S1 who? Am I right? Uh, and, you know, I can fit some decent sized cards. But the 4080. 4080 Super FE, the Founders Edition. They're clean! They fit technically, but then you can't close the panel. Unless you have, like, the slimmest 90-degree 12-volt high-power connector of all time, which I don't. So, we had to get a different 4080 Super. So, if you guys are... If anyone, like, legitimately wants a 4080 Founders Edition, put my line and pay for shipping. Nah, shipping would be included, obviously. Look at that shit. Nice and... Nice and wrapped up in a UPS padded package. It'll be pristine. Except I scraped it a little bit trying to get into my case, so it's not actually pristine. But it will not be damaged in transit. That's the important thing. Um, can you see, can you do it? Where am I like against the wall here? All right, you're getting a little too close to comfort here, Buster. All right, you're, you're getting a little too close here, Buster. Jesus. All right, that, that should not have been that hard. So this, also, like, this is supposed to be easy. Give me another jump. Huh! Really? I'm there! <laughs> Dude. All right, like, I know that it's... <sighs> I'm aware that it's humanly possible to get up, right? Dude, you cannot be fucking my butthole right now. Damn, I'm gonna get demonetized. Unfortunate. Yes! All for danger close. It was worth it, Chai. Hey, buddy. It's also a custom gold anodized NKS M1 V6.1. This shit is one of a kind, and it looks beautiful. So yeah, I could have gone with a different case, right? Could have gone like Dan A4H2O, something like that. Easily fits 4080 Founders Edition parts, free slot, thick boys. I was like, nah, Asus Pro Art that exists. It is the smallest 4080 class card to my knowledge, unless you're good, like water cool. But then you need, you know, space for the freaking rad. I have space for one rad, and it's for the PSU, or CPU, PSU, cheese. So yeah. Alright, enough of my tech talk. Back to the strategy here. Lots of laser skulls. I don't like those. I'm trying to take those out relatively first, but I'm still staying on the outside. Blue shot, or shot. Putting in work. Definitely. Definitely a winning combination. We've got another good build. It's, it's going to be similar to last run, right? Like, can I stay alive? Or will I scuff it? I really hope I can stay alive. Because this, this should be easy. At this point, it should be easy. We've got a very good foundation. Max health up to 640. We'll go by 75 each ion because we have level 3 uh, fortitude. So, we're in a good spot. We are also, we also have double vision, which is huge. We do not have any reload items, so I, I'm tempted to go auto loader here twice. So that's a nice chance there. That's 19%. So one out of every five kills will get me a good old fashioned built in reload. None of those got it. Or maybe they did, and I didn't pay attention. Still skirting the outside, like ice ants are going to be the, the biggest pains here. Although, what is that? That's an enraged scrub. We don't like that at all. But I'm thinking I can take out all of the cannon fodder first. Oh boy. Okay, and he's like really close to the distance. Just like this. It's going to be one I really want to avoid getting hit on. If I can. And that's obvious for every island. I know, I know. Captain Obvious over here, but... Still. There we go. Not not too bad. Got some 
credits over here. Chai is just like, look at this tail. Is it? It's kind of in frame. Hey, don't attack me. I know I'm grabbing your body. Oh, look at the little foot. Hi. Hello. I just can't see. Dang it, wait a minute. Wait a minute. Yes, that feels good, doesn't it? Oh, uh, oh. Yeah, he's gotta scratch himself with his foot. His foot. Hey, buddy. Oh my god, he's so cute and orange. Alright. Not too bad. Uh, I don't know. Something like that. It's not perfect, but it's back to a similar spot. Hello. Temperatures, temp check, temp check. Exact same, 56 and 48 actually, it's lower. Probably because nothing's going on on screen. All right, FPS check, 180. Let's, let's, uh, let's unlock this bad boy, come on. Oh, okay, 600. <laughs> no, not the feedback. I hit the feedback button. Yeah, that's a lot of that's a lot of damage. Wow, that's a lot of frames. Do not. Don't even start that crap. Oh my god! Don't even start that crap. Okay. No, no, you can start that crap though. I'm cool. Oh. Okay. This is this is death. This is like a loss. This is so dumb. <laughs> I don't have enough damage, I think. We've got a good health base, but we really obviously need to survive. Still. Oh my god, I thought for sure that I had committed suicide on that one. Oh no! Okay, I need to fall, right? That sucks butthole, dude. That guy's good. I just, like, cannot get hit by ice. Right. <sighs> Alright. Clip it! Good arrows are nice to have. I'll take it. I'll take it. Healing rock. Random totem. I have always said in the past, I've always said it. To my knowledge, I always end up with a better stack of items. Like, I will end up with legendaries. Like, I'll get like four legendaries. But that said, I also know that you can cheese this bad boy. Like, I can drop aura shot and glue shot so that I still have those. I can drop fortitude so I still have that. And then, like, what are the rest of these that I care about? Double vision. Let's see what happens. Alright. We got mace shot. We can enhance that. We got fire starter, which is good for fire. We got gemstone. Great. Faulty chest. Of course, that's great. Regenerating armor at level 2. I, uh, 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 and right treasure. Uh, immortality. Oh, my God. I, did I, hands up. Did I not say it? Did I not say it? That, that's insanity. And may shot with freezing, which is, of course, what I need. Fucking so dumb. <laughs> that's fine, though. It's fine, it's fine. I don't even care. I don't even care. It's fine. I'm still happy. Don't do your zoom attack, you stinky man. Oh, that's called a slut. Why did I zoom forward right there? Why did I? Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Whoa, buddy. Buddy Buster Brown. Hold your britches, dude. Get those britches. Hold them. Like a belt. Do it. Honestly, May Shot. I'll probably just get rid of it. Now that's got freezing. I'll get rid of it. It's, it's so dumb. It's so dumb. 
Like, I'd much rather have Thorn Shot. Anyway. Or Streamer Loot. That'll be nice. So, yeah. We're gonna take Gemstone. We're gonna, honestly, go a little bit aggressive. And we'll take Streamer Loot. Now, what's my Econ? Anything. Anything at all. No. Cool. Okay. Uh, no Econ, though. So, that that is where we are going to struggle. Obviously, I will get Econ from the girls. We will, we will physically get something. But I don't know about that. I'm gonna need more. And this is also a situation where my, my weapon damage is still pretty low. I'll, I'll show stats after this one. Right now I'm obviously focusing on the cacti. I'm thinking maybe I could get some driller. Or just in general it helps get the kills. So nothing wrong with it. Crystal bundle. Nice little crundle. Finishing move. We're not even a crit build anymore, so that's fine. So let's look at the stats here. 232%. 100, 100, 112, 1. So these stats are, are very weak, but level 4, level 2, that's good. And obviously, Faulty Just Regenerating Armor, Rare Treasure, Gemstone, Double Vision Streamer Loot. You know, we've got a lot of potential here with this build. But we kind of reset the stats a lot with that. Uh, with that random totem. Now, damage combo. I'm getting two plates per island with regen armor. Insanity. So, yeah, damage combo is going to be really nice. And we can get an upgrade chest. That's a good uh, good RNG. Remember this island? Remember what I said? I don't really like getting down there, but if I have to, I'll do it just to launch up. We'll go back to the outside. We'll get stuck a little bit, but that's okay. Step over there to help me out. Okay, that's a little bit concerning. Oh my gosh, they're gonna land on me and, and just bomb me from the sky. It's gonna be nuts. These enemies are not hard to kill, but there are a lot of them in a cramped space. This is a cramped island. So I'm trying my best to put, kind of train them a little bit. Not that it's working. Like, what is that? Sometimes they do that. What is that? Is that like anti-camping measures coming in hot? Very erratic movement. It's almost like they're bouncing around on a trampoline or something. That's a... Is that a fire skull? Bouncing shot? Bouncing shot might have actually saved this run. Look at that. Oh my gosh! <laughs> Just a surprise attack. What the hell? Mm -mm -mm. All right, I would love like all you can eat, obviously. Maybe even uh, my gosh, orbit shot would be just come true, right? I should, in general, get a lot more loot. Cause I got rare treasure, I've got faulty chests, I've got double vision. Like, we've got a lot of items coming our way, in theory, in the long run. So that's good. That's not everything. Not everything at all. Double vision again. It's that chance already at 28. Or one of these. Like I'm saying, I think I can avoid that for the time being though. Uh, our health is fine. Both armor and max health gain. Alright, alright. Relax. Relax, children. Look at this. Get him, John. So I'm gonna stay on the edge. They're all kind of swarming at me. It's a horde island, obviously. And some of them... I mean, look at this. Look at that. I've never actually discovered that. Oh, there's the anti-camping. Alright, alright. Maybe maybe that's, maybe that's not the strategy. Oh my god. Oh my god. That is not the strategy, ladies and gentlemen. Do not do that. <laughs> what the heck? God, we find poison shot though. We find poison shot, we find spiral shot, not even that bad. Got a grenade, can jump off a cliff, banana, might as well, I guess. Yeah, we're at, is that six? Are we at six damage? Adrenaline, we'll make room for adrenaline for sure. Now, we can handle a spike chest, we can do it. 
or a flawless horde on the top. Get some more poison, get some more fire stuff. I feel like this is better. This is a great island for it also. The uh, the barriers are very far back here. See this? I mean, it is, it is a very easy island to just run away. We'll still get some speedy boys coming at you, but... And I need to try and make sure... If you just do this the whole time, you can get in the back. You have to look every once in a while and make sure you're not doing something stupid. Fancy pumpkin, very annoying, so I focus on taking him out. I was backing myself into this corner, didn't realize it was... Wow, these barriers are in a weird spot. Like, this is a weird corner spot, in my opinion, but hey. Nice and easy. I was really hoping to get more chests there, but that's okay. Still two. So yeah, like, we can stack poison and fire starter. Yo! Did the random totem take fire shot? It did! The random totem took fire shot. No wonder it's so weird. Oh my god! That's a bug? That's a bug, right? Fire shot is gone! It is gone! Wow. I kinda want this, to be honest. But, but wow, that's interesting. Interesting. Yeah, we're not doing fire damage at all. Like, it's just gone. Wow. I, I mean, can we classify that as a glitch? That's crazy. I did not know that. That is absurd. I'm sure he'll fix that. I'll, I'll send him a clip. Because, you know, me and, me and Oyster are boys, dude. We're, so, we're best friends, for sure. He's definitely not just a dude who made a game that I covered and made content for. We're like best friends. Anyway, um, I'll let him know. He'll fix that. We're getting some rare treasure. Oh no. There's a clip. There's a clip. Press the clip button. Nothing happened. What the heck? Mm -mm 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 -mm. I mean, yeah, take the. No, I should have. <laughs> I should have, uh. Scrapped both of those, really. I'm actually gonna. Send a message now. That's insane. I no longer have fire shot on my flamethrower. Lamau! And Haley with a picture. Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh, it's a stray cat! Oh. This is the same stray cat. There's the same stray cat that's been here for like quite literally years. Years. It, it looks like there's a little bit of a, like there was a mouth injury of some sort. Like his mouth isn't fully, it's like a cleft lip almost, but like probably got in a tussle with another cat or something. But um, it's just still alive. That's insane. Okay. Uh, nothing's enhanceable. And I have, like, no income. This is goofy. Ooh, drill shot could absolutely rip and tear, brothers. I think, uh, I think we take that and we cross our fingers. And we get flaming. So that'll be good. We got our fire back. Yeah, it's drill shot, but we got it. Yep, look at those fire stacks. 
I wonder how those are happening. Could it be drill shot insane proc rate for no reason? Bro, stay away. Go flawless! Yes! <laughs> oh my god. I love it. Double key. I can get Crimson Haze too. Just go crazy. Now we'll go drill shot level two. We will go scrap a Ruski. God. Interesting. I'm still going, by the way. I'm still recording. Anyway, she's back and working out. Um, question though. Is this going to be a run that is winnable? We've got a good base. We've got a good foundation. Great health. Seemingly great damage output, especially with drill shot, blue shot, or a shot. It's doing well. Yeah, we're, we're doing some melting action. Like, uppercut will be even better. Yeah, yeah, we got the damage. I think it's just going to come down to, like, can I regain fire shot? Honestly, sharp shot's going to be better than blue shot. Go upgrade, hope to get a double. Bam, 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 bam. Oh, we didn't go flawless. Not that it matters, but it feels good to go flawless. Kind of a little bit of a weird strat here in the corner, but. Risking that. I know, I know. Health chest, man. Her health totem, blah, blah, blah. I'm not gonna risk it. Alright. Both can damage to burning, and then fire starter is fire strength increased. I'm gonna do fire starter. Have a random. What? Oh, we got fireball. Fireball guns are crazy. Like, they're actually nuts. I did not realize. Like, did he increase the spawn rate? Hit him! Dodge, duck, dip, dive, and dodge him. Yeah, the reload speed sucks. I need mean, juiced or something. Random shot? That would have fire shot in it. No! Take oil. Oh, that might be a, might be a mistake. Uh, all right, all right. Oh, he's up. Okay. Healthy scorp. Dead, but not forgotten. Gone, but not forgotten. I'm playing a little bit stupider now. More stupider. Dumb. Some would even say dumb. Because I'm very confident now with my armor, with my health, with my damage output. It's no longer like, oh crap, if I get hit, I'm ruining the run. Right? It just takes a lot to get here. And this is a, a big reason why I put this weapon so low on the tier list. And I think everyone can agree it's, it's definitely down at the bottom. I think a lot of people probably say it's the worst weapon. The one damage base is just... Ugh, it's so bad. Things just don't scale well off of one, right? It's, uh, it's too low. Uh, I don't have income, so I need this 20 grand. Take it. Econ. Maybe I can get some income. Still in the first loop, though. I I'm scared of the, of the loop scaling. I'm doing good damage, but I'm still seeing like 19, 20, 40. It's just nothing. 
nothing to brag about yet. I just don't know how it's going to be in the next elite fight. And it's not an elite fight, it's a boss. Am I going to get two King Skulls that are resistant to fire? Because right now, drill shot's doing a lot of work. Putting fire stacks. If they're fire resistant, it's going to be tough. That is... That's income, I guess. We're not, we're not gonna deal with that. Fire pumpkin, the number one op. Instantly take that out. Forking that attack. Good strats. Furnace. Wow. This guy's healthy and annoying, so we get him. Speedy, we don't like that. Armored or angered. Is it angered or armored? Doesn't matter, he's gone. Like even my uh what's it called? My ability damage is high. Global damage is only 268. I haven't done stats in a while. Let's show it off here. 348's good ish, 268. The rest is kinda of meh. Current bonus 60%, that's nice. Health gained 1800, that's huge. Vitality. Ah, I help. I'm not at high health apparently. Because I keep gaining max health, which effectively puts my uh, percentage lower. Anyway, red treasure. I'm gonna do that. All right, let's get some heals. Drill shots are splitting, homing, and flaming. That is the best we could have got. So. I feel very good about that. Uh, we're gonna deflection 25% chance to block. Yeah, we'll take that. We will take that. We'll take everything. Buy it out. All right. We're in a good spot. Very good spot. Reload. Look at all the drills. It's hard to see through the chaos, but they are melting. Look at that. Wow. Yeah. This is a good build. This is a good build. We are going to be able to get the win here. It's just going to come down to playing like not an idiot. Bonus chest could be very nice. Yeah, I'll take that. Lots of extra loot here. That, that seems to be the name of the game for my... Uh, I mean, this round. If, uh... Luck we have in the random code. Getting tired. We gotta lock in. We can probably start to do a little bit of speed running. And I just mean not caring too too much about the loot. I will say though, you can tell my damage is significantly lower. Loot. Sorry, loop. Similar word. Loop scaling is brutal. But drill shots coming in handy. I do need to get that leveled up. That is something I definitely need to find more of. And uh, something to stop these reloads. These reloads are brutal. Oh, hello. Hello, guys. All right. A lot of uh, crystals on the field, but that isn't too grand. I'll get him. I'll get him. That's fine. Dagger art. That's another big one. But I think I'm gonna not. Well, it could uh get enhance. Get rid of spiral shot just because it's meh. <sighs> we need it though. Greed. Let's go greed. There needs to be an income greed. That's right. The treasure coming in hot. Now, if I could get Dagger Arc to do some homing or 
sticky. Anything like that. Oh my god. It's gonna be insane. Really? Big Claws could be nice. Crystal Dividends, obviously nice. Finishing move we don't care about. Eh, I'll be, I'll be fine without that. All right, what do we get? Rising Star. Let's drop. Rising Spawn. Yep. That's fine. That's a, that's a double win. Uh, the last fight was easy, so I think I can take the lead and not worry about it. Yeah, that's not too bad. Yeah, this ain't too bad. Though I do kind of want to get these guys close together. Whoa. Whoa. Oh, there's a third. What the F? I mean, I, I knew that in the back of my head. Surely, but my brain did not see it. <laughs> They're gone. The lack of fire shot. But he has a lot of stacks, so. Yeah, we're good. We're good. Double vision, too. Very helpful. More drill shot. We'll take that. Bonus crystals. We can take that. Or scatter shot. Honestly, scatter shot could be great. New upgrade. Not another elite. I'm good on that for a while. That was harder than it should have been, so... Like, these are gonna be hectic. Very hectic. It's gonna be imperative that I don't lose my cool here. I just... Fall into the water and just really scuff it. Honestly, let's get everyone who's not shielded, maybe. If they're all in a close proximity, then Drill Shot will actually hit everyone. It'll be great. Dude, when Skulls are uh, shielded. Specifically Bottom Skulls. You can barely see that they're shielded. It's very odd. I'm not getting that many kills, and Double Vision's going to be better, right? Right? Maybe. Maybe. Oh, lower back is tight. Thank you for instantly hitting me. Messing that up. I would love to just sit here. I would love to just sit here. Let me do it. Yes. You can see their health bar really melt. And that's gotta be the drills, right? It's gotta be. Oh, because the drills are homing, so they probably home back on the original target. Is that possible? It should be. I think it's possible. And I think that's what's happening. Uh, I'll say it. I don't care that you hurt your elbow. You can never go wrong with more health, right? We could get... Whoa. Whoa. Nighttime. Whoa. All right. Bird. Can't see shite. <laughs> Dinkleberg. <laughs> Whee! Rare treasure. <laughs> Great. Now the builds come together. It's doing well. Definitely a little bit better on these types of islands than uh, you know leads. But that's okay. We really only have a few more of those. It's not imperative that it's perfect. That. Do I just auto loot at this point? Do we start auto looting. This is speed. I want to get something nice. I'm not sure why any of those are in there, but I guess we take. Take what it'll give me. Juice. Yeah. That's fine. That song's so 
so cute. Alright, we're getting uh, pretty good. Chaotic. Sticky. Homing! They're chaotic, but they home. Oh, man. That's, that's the one. That's the one. We got it. We got the win. So now I'm going to uh, genuinely try to go fast. Obviously, a lot of these runs, like, it, it really is just about, about getting a start, getting some luck, or just in general playing well. You got to play well for a couple of biomes. If you don't, if something messes up, you're, you're going to struggle. Just look at the amount of daggers. I'm, I'm taking a good amount of damage here. You need to be careful. But there it is. My god. This is nice. Uh, I want double vision level 5. 56%. Now, double tap is very good. Now, was it worth having my health? I don't know. But the thing that's good is we do still have lots of fortitude. I didn't get rid of it. Sometimes I do get rid of it. Didn't get rid of it here. So, we got a good spot to regain that health. Won't be fast, but it will get back. So, I, I don't think I'm too, too concerned. But, you know. Probably something I could have looked out for a bit better. Seems like that was a lot of... Oh boy. Be smarter. I was, I was getting nervous right there. I was like, ah. <laughs> trying not to get hit by that. I don't know how many times the, you know, you can easily, I got like six hits on one hit. That was a lot of uh, energy ranks that could have happened right then and there. Right then and right there. So nine levels of crystal dividends, baby. Whoop, whoop, whoop. This is nuts. This is genuinely insane. But this build is not necessarily like, oh, it's a, it's a flamethrower build. It's not, right? This is just a dagger arc drill build with lots of extra loot. And typically you wouldn't go for lots of extra loot build in Nammo. But sometimes you gotta just go for it and launch this dude off the edge. I want him to die. I want him to fall off. Let's go. Get out of here, buster. It's so funny. So funny to me. Crystal divot and six more time, 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 times. Boom, 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 boom. The freaking daggers almost look like the flamethrower. Like, look at that. This is absolutely nuts. This is insanity. The daggers are actually cracked. You're getting the homing enhancement is just broken. But it's not like I needed this build. I had the win on probably two of the other ones that just, like, messed up, right? Ultimately, what happened? Like, I didn't play well. Destroy destructible rocks. I mean, uh, I guess. Or bigger boom. <laughs> I'll take that, I guess. I guess. Dude, I don't want bigger boom. Elemental. Oh. I hear those snipers. That sniper sound is scary. What is this? Oh boy. Oh boy. Oh me oh my. Stop it. Stop it. Get some help. That was crazy. I'm just clipping every single island at this point. This is an insane run. Like these are these are clips, dude. This guy's got clips. 
Wow. Clip it. Uh, damage to poison or poison strength. <laughs> he high hoo. Toxic's got to be better, right? I don't know. I don't know. Big mag. Eagle eye. Also, we got we got a lot of money. 1.95 milli on the beat. It's a sick rap. Man. Can't even disagree. Still taking way too much damage though. I'm playing like an idiot. I got no actual healing. I have max health increasing. I do not have healing. I need healing. Can you not? Get out of here. Be done. Thank you. Thank you very much. No, oh, I like actually don't want that at all. It's a stamina build now too. Can I goopy? I don't need it. <laughs> I actually don't need it. What I actually need is fire shot. Unironically. Like why how do I not have that still? I know I said it would go fast, but there's all you can eat. Vitality's... I'll keep it. I'll keep it. Whatever. Whatever. Easily 50k. <sighs> All right. Sorry, I know I'm probably boring you to death. Triangle shot would potentially be nice, but no, we do not care. All right. I forgot to show stats. My bad. Can we get rid of this little man? That was sloppy, but easy win. So, let's check out the stats. 328, not very high. Global damage is where we're killing it, 868. Crystal gain's decent. Obviously, this having a 19% proc chance, but we're fine. Uh, chance to deal damage twice. Really, only 19%? Hmm. This is only 18%. It seems like it's proccing a lot. So, I mean, God, imagine what's going to happen when these are both like level 10. Good poison. Somehow still not a fire shot, but aura shot, glue shot. Nice combo here. Um, down here, decent amount of damage gained from gemstone. Vitality bonus is nice. Fortitude giving me a good chunk of health. Nice damage combo. Damage increase. What else? Money is power at 200%. Huge, huge. Total crystal gain of a bajillion. All right. Two biomes remain. This is a walk in the park at this point. But even now, I still can't play like an idiot. You know, 3,900 health. It's a lot, but it's not 50,000, you know? The only reason I'm able to feel very confident is just the amount of damage I'm doing. It's quite decent. So. We will auto loot that because it's not a huge deal. Fire pumpkin? No, regular. Fire pumpkin? No, regular. Fire pumpkin? No, regular. Absolutely smacking. Random totem. Fire ring. There we go. I 
Probably should have made an effort to look there and try to get fire shot, but double relic chest. Firing is great. Now does it ice no one has anything? That's fine. I'm gonna say if it's poison, oh my god, we're screwed. This is quite a lot of shrapnel, but that Scorpion had no chance. Yeah, buddy, you're done. Combo rank, get the combo even higher. That would benefit this build a lot. Reload speed increased. Let's aim at it twice. Spike and armor doesn't seem to matter with their armor. Which feels good. Normally, armor is kind of a pain. Or at least it definitely has the potential. And me being on fire does not help. But uh, obviously, we get through that. No problem. I'm hoping for. Dude, I've got. Uh, what is this? Stream Elite level 2. 200% higher. You would expect a little bit of nice items here and there. Right? There it is. Supercharged. Da -da -da -da. Elemental. Do we pay attention and actually get fire shot this time? I don't next time on Dragon Ball PP. Because everything's homing, I actually don't have to aim that much, right? I gotta play to my strengths on a poison build right now. Arcane. <laughs> Arcane shot would actually be crazy right now. Right? Relic ring, try to get a relic chest. Try to get something different than what I already have. I already have six, so. You know, like, how, how important is it gonna be? We will see. It's possible I get a bunch of duds. Like, three rings reloading. It's like, alright. Oh, that guy's. Strong man. That's a strong woman. Ring of armor. Like that. I don't need it because I have freaking regen armor. We got raw armor. armor. Ring of gravity. Now that is just uh that 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 there that right there is what we want. This one up and by taking the random totem. No, no, we're gonna go ahead and not. We're gonna go ahead and not do that. A oh, rapid fire could be fun, funny, f -f 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 funny, fun and funny. Spike strike. John, you got him with your spikes. You striked him. How'd it feel? Torange. Normally I'd take it, but I don't think we need it, and I'm gonna be cocky about it. We're gonna we're gonna ignore it. Bubble blast. Hey, fire shot. You know what I should do is get every element you need like by itself plus random shot that's what we should do that's what i should do john glot we got glot brother now at, at this point you know it's obviously gg but hopefully you enjoy the rest of this run i won't uh i won't stretch it out too long 
I'll go ahead and get him. Logitech C920 on Craigslist for like 30 bucks. Facebook Marketplace, baby. Let's go. Dude, just kidding. Glot. This is quite nice. I don't know about you guys, but I think this is quite nice. I'm doing well. And being able to fly is... It's funny because Lightweight was a perk that effectively made your character low gravity. You floated. <laughs> like, like, that's what it was. And he took it out of the game because he was like, oh, you, no flying. And now it's just part of the game. You can, you can soar. No, my... Oh, no. Oh, wait a minute. No, this is way slower. Yeah, this is slower. This is slower, right? Ow. We can do it! <laughs> wow, they have it. Very slow parkour islands. Um, yeah, this is, this is not the move. Bonk. Wow. Well done. Pretty nice, though. Decent rewards. Alright. Take this guy out. Bad. Oh, we upgraded flammable arm, and that's that's disappointing. <laughs> that's disappointing. All right, that's fine. Still an easy little island. Now, what if I were to go ahead and just chill back here with the armored fire points? If I were to just rain down on everyone like an AC-130, how would we feel then? What if it were just a homing grub, chilling? Uh, one last elite? Unfortunately, they do not know what hit them. Uh, yeah, un <laughs> unfortunately, they are unaware of what just happened. Well done. We've got clone explosions, so might as well do a little snaking damaging. What? Doesn't work. That doesn't make sense. Uh, this guy, what is he doing? Spore shot too, just to have it. Just to have some spore shot, can I, uh, can't enhance it, ah, sad, sad day when you can't enhance spore shot, oh yeah, I'm kind of just, obviously I don't need to shop anymore, but this is a fun build, so I'm gonna see what else I can get. else enhanceable. Okay. Well, what do you think, guys? Good run? Good tips? If this helped at all, appreciate it. Appreciate you watching. Like the video. Subscribe to the channel for more Crab Champions. I'm your guy, you know? Uh, 
we should have another spawn. There he is. Wow. I'm going to try to get him with the, uh, the name here. Psych. Boop. And, yeah. That's, that's a good run. That's how you win Diamond Flamethrower. Not the first try, but stick with it. Let's look at our stats real quick one last time. 841. Not bad there. 1800. That's obviously the real money maker. Global damage. Drill shot was the bread and butter. Eventually it became dagger arc level 10. Almost 50% chance. Smacking. Funny that uh, random totem can take away fire shot from the flamethrower. But we got it back eventually. Four shot glue shot was great as well at the beginning of the game. It's a nice combo to carry a little bit. Then obviously uh, drill and dagger took over. All of these extra loot items with faulty chest, rare treasure, bonus chest, uh, double vision, streamer loot. That was hugely helpful. And then obviously uh, regen armor level 2 from the random totem. Never really had to worry about my health too much, so that was great. Uh, fortitude, hugely important. Almost 8,000 health. So yeah, that's that You know, it eventually came together. Like I said earlier, we had some runs in this, in these attempts where, like, I clearly could have won if I played a little bit better. Skill issue, died early, died uh, into the second loop, or just, like, died early when I shouldn't have. Like, had a really good orbiting shot run, and then died on, like, 14 or whatever that was. So, well done to myself. Again, if this helped, like the video, subscribe to the channel for more Crab Champions content. I'm your guy, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care.